Hi, hello, guys and gals. It's Red, your friendly neighborhood tool bear, back again here in the old den of tools. And of course, today is Monday, May 2nd, which means it's time for Deals of the Week. All right, let's jump into it. First, quick recap if you didn't see my video on this, you need to check this out. This is a, a third party power inverter that takes DeWalt batteries, but not, not just DeWalt, they have it for the M18. They have it for Makita, and they have it for Black & Decker. That's the only four that they have it for right now. Now, just to just let you know, this is a modified sine wave power inverter, not a, a pure sine inverter. So don't use this on delicate electronics. I know in, in some of the pictures, they show it charging a drone and a laptop. Uh, on the laptop, maybe, depending on your power supply, I definitely would not use this on a drone or any other kind of delicate electronics. Again, that's your call on that, but it's a cheap way to get a power inverter. And the company saw, I did the video on it, they, they said, you know what, we're going to get you a discount code. Now, the discount code currently, and I checked it, it only works on the DeWalt one. I, I went back to them and I said, hey, can you get us a discount code for the other three? We'll have to wait and see on that. But that said, the $69 takes it down to $55 for with the with the discount code for the DeWalt. I'll put the links to all four down below. And if I get the discount codes for the other ones, I will add them after the fact. But you know, even still, this one's already at 10% off, so $61. That's already got a discount on it. This one's at $69, and you can click the coupon to get 10% off on that one. So there's that. And then this one's at $75. And well, you know, come on, it's it's a black and decker battery. How many people have those? Uh anyway, moving on. <laughs> Knipex, Knipex, however you want to pronounce it uh they've got their pliers wrench with the black finish with the softer grip handles right rather than the regular ones because i have some of the the nipex with the 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 just a regular uh fitted or the i guess it's plastic dipped handles uh, i mean they look nice they feel okay but when you really put some pressure on them you're going to want these foam handles here that's on sale right now for $41.23. That's a pretty decent deal considering that in the last three months, it's been as high as $79. Now, typically, I would say, you know, previously, it's been in the just like just sub uh, $50 range. So you're, you know, based off of that, that's the $48 you know, kind of, kind of level there. But that said, unless you got a time machine, this is going to be the deal to get right now. All right, moving on. We've got here. We got the Cobra pliers for twenty eight fifty five. These are the uh, the eighty. I think you figure out their model number. I hate Nipex's model numbers. They're seven. Was seven and a quarter, seven and a half inch. So they're going for twenty eight bucks. And, and uh, as far as pricing on these, they're pretty decent. Uh, you know, the twenty eight dollars. I think that that's been. That's one of the best prices I've seen in, in quite some time on that one. Next up, we've got the uh, we, the Knipex bolt cutters. We're going to have some more bolt cutters later on. We're gonna, And they're almost identical to this, but these are the made in Germany ones. Uh, at least I, I think they're made in Germany. Anyway, the, the Knipex is $32.56 on this. Uh, and uh, let's see here. How much do these things... Normally go for the normally go for I, I actually guess that's about the standard price. I'll try. I include sorry. I did include these because we're going to be talking about the other ones later. Just to give you a comparison. All right, Avid Power. Now Avid Power is an online. I think they're an Amazon only brand, and this is not a high level case or anything. You're not going to get blown away by the quality of any of this. This is kind of a go case for just sorts of bits and stuff like that. If you got to have something to like to put in the truck, take with you, take you know on on you know your your wife sending you on honeydew projects for someone else kind of stuff you know what i mean thirty dollars there you get three dollars off with the coupon and you have basically one of everything if not two of everything you got all the bits around the outside that's an interesting choice in storage but you got a whole saw in there and you got other bits and spade bits and some nut drivers and stuff so it's going to cover most of the kind of stuff you're probably going to run into for 30 what's 27 dollars i guess that may not be a bad pickup for you Next up, we're going to talk about Set Power. Okay, Set Power, we did the video on this, the cooler the other day. Their sale is still going on right now. Uh, some of it is ending tomorrow, May the 5th. So the, uh, you know, got to look around here, look at what, you, you know, what's going on here. We got, uh, we got the cooler, the cooler that they sent me there. It is 250 right there. These things are pretty awesome. I like them. And a lot of people are like, well, I'll just get some ice, you know, and, and a cooler and stuff. 
I don't know if you've seen the price of ice lately, if you have to buy ice to fill it up. If you got enough ice in your fridge, good on you. But, you know, for my family of five, going out and as often as we use something like this, uh, these things are, are fantastic. Anyway, moving on, Craftsman. Now, this is a set we see normally around Black Friday for $100. Usually, it's, it's a good bit more expensive than that. And, you know, it's $120 right now, and I'm, I'm calling that out because... You know, it, it's a, it's, we see this at Lowe's pop down to this price every so often, but here it is on Amazon. So you can just order it, get it sent. You don't have to go in the store. And, you know, if you're into the craftsman stuff, and I'll be honest, I'm not a huge fan of the new craftsman. All right. And I'm not going to sit here and say, this is the best set. This is totally different. It's going to blow you away. It's not. It's a decent home grade, homeowner grade set. And if you're in the versus stack system, that's where this starts to add value. Or if you just need a, a set of hand tools to set there, you know, up on the workbench. So you've got like, look, you know, there, I've got three drawers. I got three drawers of tools, like a half inch, quarter inch and three eighths, you know, just a great workbench kind of, you know, accessory set. You maybe you have got better tools than that. I'm sure you do, but just in case. All right, moving on. We've got the DeWalt. Somebody asked about miter saws in the live stream the other day. And uh, here's the DeWalt 12 inch double bevel compound miter saw with the drop light, drop shadow line there, the XPS line, 15 amp, normally 379. This is 303. This is usually, a, I think you usually find it for around 350 or so. This is a great price on this. Now it's not a sliding miter saw. It's not, you know, the, the big boy kind of thing, but for a 12 inch DeWalt miter saw with the drop shadow light, 303 is a fantastic price and if you've never used a saw with the sh drop shadow light as opposed to the laser or no no light work, you will not be able to go back this is that's the only way to use it all right we got the bosch colt this is their trim router not the best trim router out there but a decent little trim router and at that price 79 dollars. if you like the bosch stuff if you've been looking for an inexpensive trim router that might be the one to pick up there moving on Tech Kikapo. This is a this is the drill that blows everyone away. This is a, a you know uh let, let's be honest. All right, hopefully hopefully uh, Amazon isn't listening. This is owned by Aki. This is the same people that make Tech Life and and got kicked off of Amazon for for you know fake uh, fake reviews and stuff or or not fake reviews but basically sending people products and then having them post reviews. Uh, and which is against the terms of service on Amazon. We never do that kind of stuff. It, it's, you know, we believe in full transparency and all that. Uh, but, but the fact of the matter is, this is a really decent drill. I've given one to some pros that I know who still use it. I've had tons of people reach out to me and be like, you know what? I got one of those, those tech, nobody can pronounce it. Those green and yellow drills. That's what everyone calls it. The green and yellow drill. And it's phenomenal. It's got a metal chuck. It's high speed. It, it's brushless. You get two batteries. The bits are the bits are worthless. Let's be honest, the bag's not terrible. The charger's okay. But I mean, honestly, for the money, for ninety dollars, it's not a bad drill. And you're gonna save. Get this, twenty bucks. So that makes this a a seventy dollar brushless half inch drill with a metal chuck. Good luck finding that somewhere else. All right, moving on. We got Nico. Love me some Nico. Nico's again one of these companies out there that kind of been a sleeper. We, uh, I had, I reached out there, you know, year, years ago, about three or four years ago. I don't remember how long it was. The community reached out to me and said, "Hey, Bear, you gotta check out uh, uh, Tecton," and we did. And Tecton, uh, you know, we we kind of opened the door for Tecton, and people really realized who they were and what they were and everything else. Well, I said, well, who's going to be the next tech and who's going to be the next company out there that we need to talk about? And I had a lot of people say, hey, you got to check out Nico. And here's their half inch drive master set. Hundred and twenty two dollars on that. It's a it's a decent price. And but these are really, you know, decent, you know, uh, impact sockets here. They did send me uh, I don't think it was this. Set. I think you should think it was a bigger set than this. They did send that to me. I'm just going to say this, though. And this is addressed to Nico and any other company out there. If you're going to send me stuff tell me first <laughs> they sent it to our old address and i had no idea there was something there the wife just happened to swing by and there's this giant box of power tools because nico's now also selling power tools uh anyway uh oh there it is there's the uh the they've got the uh that was a half inch uh impact wrench here they've got and this is not brushless 
but most of the other stuff they have is brushless. There was a brushless grader, a brushless impact. Uh, I think there was a multitude. I don't remember. It was a whole bunch of stuff there. They had an SDS hammer. I was like, are you serious? But they did. So anyway, it was kind of funny. All right, let's move along here. So going once we're we at the tech po we talked about, Nico we talked about. Oh, the the Roo tool, Japanese hand saws. I like Japanese hand saws. Now, if any of you ever used a flush cut saw, that's the nice thing about these is because basically you've got a double edged flush cut saw, and that's what this kind of is. You can do all sorts. You can do regular cuts, flush cuts. They uh, they are a, a I, I think they're superior to your our standard, you know, U.S. rip style saw. I really like them. Anyway, eighteen dollars on this, and you can save an extra twenty percent. So ten percent would be a buck eighty. So it's at three sixty off that price. You can do the rest of the math math there. Anyway, moving on, we've got this. I just picked these up. Could not find my magnetic extension pickup tool, and so I grabbed one of these, uh, the three pack here for fifteen dollars twenty nine cents, and you get an extra five percent off. So it'd be about 75 cents or so. It's going to take it down to 14 something. Anyway, I, I grabbed one of these. I keep one in the toolbox here. I put one in the truck and I, I gave one to a neighbor. He needed one as well. So anyway, I was, they got a nice hefty handle on it. Good grip. You got the little you know, pen style clip on it. They, they seem pretty solid. Can you break them? Sure. I'm sure if you wanted to, you could probably break them. They're the short lifting a probably empty fire extinguisher. Uh, anyway, Goes out to 31 inches. They're a solid pickup tool. All right. Next up, we've got, speaking of SDS rotary hammers, Tilswall. Now, this is hilarious. Tilswall, we've dealt with, you know, they've they've been friends of the channel for some time. Haven't heard much from them lately. But they did, like, soldering irons, rotary tools, that kind of stuff. Small stuff. All of a sudden, boom, out of nowhere, they come out with an SDS plus rotary hammer drill. 1500 watt four function adjustable soft grip handle vibration control yada 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 this thing is is a hundred bucks and you get 10 bucks off so that's a 90 dollars sds hammer drill there corded of course and it comes with a bunch of the bits and, and stuff and you got the uh, cylinder lubricant there and and everything else that is and the nice little case there as well that was i was surprised to see them come out with this i just want to throw this out there um I, I, I don't know the quality. I haven't used it. I don't even have a use for a rotary hammer like that right now. Maybe when we get back to Montana, I'm sure I can find some stuff to do with it. All right, next up, we've got, back to Nico, we got the aluminum socket holders. I saw these on sale. These are some nice-looking socket holders. I like the red on this. You got your triple set three-piece there for $25. All right, what do we got next here for you? We got, oh, this is the one I just talked about. Uh, and again, now also, remember I said on the live stream, People were talking about, uh, you know, and if you didn't see the live stream, every Sunday we try to do a live stream. Jeff and the missus does it. I, I take the weekend off. I, I don't work weekends. I'm talent. I don't, you know, that's that's for the plebes to do. Anyway, somebody asked about electric ratchets and what the best, you know, the best bang for the buck out there is. And, of course, that's, you know, there, there's a lot of flavors out there. So I'm going to show you real quick kind of the spectrum in bang for the bucks. This is about the cheapest you're going to find. I'm not going to talk about the quality of this, but if you just want something cheap, just to check out the whole e-ratchet scene and see if it's for you, 39, 38, 42 there, it's going to get you two batteries. They're the, you know, they're the kind you have to plug in. There's no base charger. You got some sockets. I can see from the picture, I can see issues with the sockets or at least with the chrome plating, but you know, you're paying $38 for this. So, um, it should probably most likely work anyway. seems interesting. $38. Now here's, we take a step up. You want an actual, like say paddle grip on it, paddle trigger on it. You want some batteries that are kind of standard in the industry. You can find replacement batteries like that all over Amazon and other places. You got an actual charging base. You got some more sockets there. You got some adapters. You have a nice hard case for it. This is one I would probably lean more towards. $68 gets you the whole set there. Now, the next step up from that, if you want a long handle, we got the S long <laughs> and again you got pretty much the same batteries look at this we got some uh we got some more sockets those bit adapters those are interesting we got a charging handle even comes with a ratchet as well and you get a soft a semi-rigid case i guess there and you're getting that for 95 dollars. so for the extended reach one that's kind of nice now of course 
my go-to that I often recommend is the AC Delco combo kit here. You're getting the quarter inch and you're getting the three eighths there for $140, but you save 10 bucks and now it's $130 on that. You're getting the battery, the charger, and the bag on that. The one thing there is I think you're only getting one battery, which is kind of a downside on this one, but AC Delco has got a bigger line of tools. There, there's some names behind it and, and there's a name behind it where they actually provide products and stuff. So you may have some better luck with warranty and stuff like that with that. Now, of course, if you're already in, like, say, the M12 line, how's this for a deal? Check that out. We got the M12 3.8 lithium-ion bare tool ratchet for $79, $78.95. That's a pretty good price on that, actually. All right, let's check over at Ace. Now, Ace, of course, I love supporting Ace, my local hardware stores, when I can, and other, especially other independent hardware stores. Harder to find published deals for them. But always remember, when you're looking at Ace, look for stuff that's got the Ace Rewards uh, sales on it. It doesn't cost anything to sign up for the Ace Rewards. $55 on a six-foot wheelbarrow. I checked around. That's a pretty decent price. And if you're looking for your basic wheelbarrow, that's the one I would go with, all right? Now, let's hop over to Home Depot and see what Big Orange can get us. Not a ton of savings going on. But here's the other bolt cutters I was talking about. This is HK Porter, which used to be, I think, made in Boston. These are being clearanced out for $11.49. How much were the Kinepex ones? They were $32. So just comparison. Now, these are no longer, I don't believe they're made in the USA. I couldn't find anything. And as I always say, if they are made in the USA, they will scream it from the mountaintops on the tool. It'll say in big, bold print somewhere, made in USA. And I'm not seeing that. I don't have my glasses on, but maybe I'm missing it. Anyway, this is a brand that is now owned by, um, uh, uh, what do you call it? By, there we go, by Crescent. <laughs> I knew I'd figure it out sooner or later. Anyway, so this is a brand owned by Crescent. They make a ton of bolt cutters. They're good quality bolt cutters. Don't get me wrong. Uh, but don't sit there and see the HK Porter and think this is still a made in the USA brand. All right, next up, we've got ShopFox. Now, ShopFox, for those of you who don't know, I know most of you do, for those of you who don't know, that is owned by, actually by Grizzly. No relation here, but Grizzly, they don't, they sell direct, but they also have a brand that they call ShopFox that they allow other retailers to wholesale and resell through. So this, essentially, you're buying a Grizzly here. Now, the price on it is price and cart. It's $4.14. Price and cart, they knock off $100, almost $100, takes it down to 320 all right uh, th and let me just point out though this is a two blade joiner this is not spiral cut nothing fancy this is a two blade joiner all right we got some dewalt deals here we got a two amp four amp and six amp we got the stair step batteries there going on 100 I was 149 dollars there for all three also we've got check this out a bosch one and the eighth SDS concrete masonry rotary hammer there with carrying case for $144. That is a screaming deal on a Bosch. Why so cheap? Well, it's factory reconditioned, as it says right here, right at the beginning. Factory reconditioned there. But you know what? If it's reconditioned by Bosch, I'm pretty much okay with it. I think that's a screaming deal. And if you're looking for corded, and I got to say, when it comes to stuff like this, corded usually has a longer runtime than a battery. Just saying. Anyway. We got, here's a four pack of M12 stuff. I love these tools, man. We got the drill driver. We got the impact. We got the ratchet. We got the one-handed resip. Uh, you get two batteries, bag, and the charger there for $220. Special buy there. It's 47% off the list price. All right, now we're going to head over to Heat Waves. You know, Heat Waves is a friend of the channel. They've sent us some stuff. I have I've dropped, I gave my Maui gems to my daughter. She looks, she looks, why do my kids look better in my sunglasses than me? I don't understand. The Cubs are always stealing my stuff. Anyway, I give them to her. She looks good in them. I am now fully committed to the, uh, the heat waves. I love them. Just great, you know, nice, good coverage, stuff like that. Solidly made. They're made in Taiwan, designed in California. Uh, great company. I've talked to them a bunch. Anyway, this is their new, they're re-releasing this. They had this come out before as a limited edition. And they, they're raising money for the Cal Fire Benefit Fund. And 10% uh, of all sales goes towards that. They did so well, they're re-releasing them. So if you want to support the Cal Fire people, and you know what? It's just got a darn good look to it. They've got this in the, what, I don't know how to pronounce it, Marotos. Anyway, and they also have it in the, uh, 
in the laser face. Love that name. Uh, anyway, these are these are the ones that I wear mostly. Not this specific style. I've got a, a different style, but uh, I love the coverage on this, and they're comfortable. They're lightweight and stuff. Anyway, fifty-five dollars on those, fifty dollars on these. Again, ten percent goes towards the Cal Fire uh, fund. All right, next up we've got the Dewalt Extreme. Now we're over at Lowe's on this. This is Dewalt's twelve volt brushless line. Now, if you've heard me before, you saw my old videos. I was really down on the the Dewalt. 12 volt line but that was the brushed line and they were junk let's just be call call a spade a spade there they were just complete and utter you know what so but the 12 volt extreme brushless series is fantastic and what we got here is we got an impact we got a a drill driver we got the two batteries the charger and the bag for 200 dollars. but wait don't order yet because it's a BOGO. You buy one one here and get this. So you got to get the hammer drill. You can get the one-hand recip. You can get, I what is this? The uh, Oh, the half-inch drive cordless impact. That is a compact cordless little impact. They got the SDS. They got also, we got the, the saw. You can get uh, a three-eighths impact. You can get the, uh, the, the, the oscillating multi-tool. This is a heck of a deal when you count that in. You get three of these brushless 12-volt batter or uh, battery powered tools you get the two batteries the charger in the bag for 200 bucks that's a great deal right there all right now over at direct tools of course direct tools being the outlet for tti that's milwaukee ryobi uh rigid heart and some other was a dirt devil and i think hoover and some other ones that said again where i was keeping an eye out for miter saws because people were asking about miter saws so we get the ryobi 10 inch again it's not a sliding miter saw it's just your basic miter saw but it's $90 there, 90 bucks on that one. Also at Direct Tools, we've got, check this out, we've got the Ryobi HP Compact Brushless 3 8 Impact Rich Kit. You're getting, the, uh, you're getting the battery, you're getting the charger, you're getting the bag, and you're getting the impact there for $80. Factory blemished on this. The other one was factory reconditioned. And then last but not least, we've got the Ryobi Universal Miter Saw Quick Stand here. This is uh, factory blemished for $70. So if you're looking for a lightweight miter saw stand, 70 bucks, that might be the way to go. All right. Now remember, I saved the best to last and we're not quite there yet. We got the works. This thing is, I, I got to tell you, I've, I saw the infomercials on this when it came out and I thought it looked cheesy and gimmicky and yada, yada, yada. Buddy of mine in Livingston got one for his house. They just built a new house. He's doing a ton of landscaping. He needed to wear a wheelbarrow. And so he got one of these. And I'm like, this thing is a joke. And then I saw it. And I'm like, this thing is fantastic. <laughs> so what I did not realize about this is this little lip down here. That turns it into a dolly. Shut up, iPhone. That turns it into a dolly. So you can sit there and you can look at this. Yeah, you can do stuff like that, and we have moved stuff like that for them. On top of that, I don't know if you can see, they got these little arms down here. Those fold out. Where did it, where's the picture on that? Those fold out and become like a little mini crane kind of thing, and we use that for moving landscaping rocks and stuff. <laughs> plant, I guess you can move a plant with it. This thing is really versatile. It's got the two wheels, which means it's stable as all heck. Uh, I, I'm just stunned at how much I like this. Now, I looked at pricing and standard pricing I could find everywhere else was like uh, 200 or just under 200. This is 142, $143 there on that. If you're looking for a wheelbarrow for around the house, I I don't know how you could go wrong with this. I mean, yeah, it's a bit more expensive than the standard one you saw over there at Ace. But I mean, considering that, and I, you know the bear, if you've been around the channel, I'm adamant that every home needs to have a dolly on it you, you gotta be able to move stuff you gotta work smarter and not harder don't hurt that back and if you're moving big stuff work smart use the right tools and this this is going to cover a lot of bases there all right moving along coleman pop-up all right i'm always looking for a new pop-up because we're always seem to be damaging the one we have 75 dollars on that that's a great price on any straight leg instant canopy kind of thing that's a great price but on top of that, it comes with the sun wall, which is, that's an add-on. You usually have to buy extra to put on these things. That's fantastic. You're sitting at the soccer game. You're on a work site. You're doing anything. You're down at the cove. Get a, got that sun trying to sneak under through the back. 
Yeah, and you're trying to do the weird thing like where you set like the back legs lower than the front legs, and it's kind of forget that. Put on the sun wall, have all the headroom you need. You are set and ready to go. I love these canopies, man. Seventy-five dollars is a no-brainer. This is over at Target. Okay, real quick before we get to the ultimate deal of the week, got to talk about this. Harbor Freight came out with a giant liquidation flyer. Oh my gosh, we're back to this. We're back to this. But there is one thing that a lot of people probably overlooked on this when they when it came out and when they saw it. And that is, let me zoom in on this because this is a this is pretty big. Let's see, it's not down there. It's a, look at we got the new racing jack there. You know, for you kids out there, then being kids racing their their floor jacks, hundred bucks on that. Uh, check this out. Save an additional. 30% off all clearance items, no coupons needed, up to 84% off. An additional 30%. That is, so if your store's got clearance items, that, just go, go around check. That's the one that's the end cap. It's got, usually got the purple, you know, uh, uh, banner above it saying clearance. 30% off all clearance items. Don't need a coupon. Just go up, make sure, make sure when they ring it up, you get the you get the clearance price and the thirty percent off, but you know, and you can pull it up on the website if they have any questions at the new cashier or something. But you don't need a coupon or anything. That is the way to go. All right, here we go. Ultimate deals of the week, and I know it's we're gonna get in repetitive here because it is a generator. And in fact, it's not one but two because they send they tend to sell out so quickly. And that's the thing. This is an Amazon. So when people click on this, if enough people buy it fast enough, the price goes up. Maybe wait a day or two, see if the price sinks back down. First up, we've got, in the second place, because it's kind of a tie, we got the Westinghouse. This is your 2200 peak. This is your small gas generator here. It, it's not going to run like a big AC unit or something. This is for camping power kind of stuff. Super quiet, portable, $364 on that. That is a fantastic deal on that generator there. It's normally been in the four to five hundred dollar range, so we're well below any of that. And at two, and if, here's what I'm going to say: if you do need to run an AC unit, what you do is you grab two of these and you run them in parallel. That's an option because we get a lot of people who are like, "Well, I'm going to get a bigger generator." They look at the bigger generators and like, "Where am I going to put this?" Especially in your RV, there's not a lot of giant storage spots, and most people don't want to like just leave their generator, you know, bolted to the back of, of the RV. Well, get two of these, and now you can move them separately. You can take. You want to go off camping? You just only need one. You can take one. It gives you flexibility. Gives you a lighter load. Get lets you get redundant power, kind of stuff. Always a good option. Then there's this. Champion. Dual fuel. 4375. 3500 running. 4375 peak. Dual fuel. RV ready portable generator. $280. Are you kidding me? This is a $700 generator. Eight days a week, man. This thing is always in that, that five, six, seven hundred dollar range. And we're looking at at two hundred bucks, two hundred eighty dollars. This is just a ridiculous price. Champion is a good name, a well name known out there. That is now it's not a super quiet inverter generator or any of that. But man, if you just need power, <coughs> but man, if you just need power, this is the way to go. This is some cheap power right there. Two hundred eighty dollars. All right, well, there you go. That is the Bears' choice for the, the ultimate deal of the week. Let me know what you think. Did the Bear nail in on those two there? Was there something better? Did the Bear miss out on a better deal of the week? Anyway, don't forget to check out the Facebook group. we got tons and tons of great deals on the Facebook group. At, the links are down below to that. There's the uh, We're on Instagram and on the old ticky tocky thing kind of over there. Also, don't forget to check us out every Sunday for uh, the live stream. We'd love to have you all there. It's a great community of people uh, hang out and talk about tools and food and life and whatnot. So it, we do talk about tools, but we talk about other stuff. It's just a bunch of friends hanging out, having a good time on a Sunday evening. Anyway, that's all the bear has for you today. Don't forget, Mama's Day is coming up. I hope you're ready. I did the video last week setting you up. You got no excuses at this point. The bear helped you out. Make sure you got that Mother's Day gift and you treat that woman right. 
<laughs> that's all the bear has for you today. You all take care. God bless. And as always, shine on.